What's going on boys and girls, it's Flint here from Backyard Blasters. In today's video we're doing a range test of the High Kappa Dart Gun. So this blaster uh, I reviewed it quite a while ago. Um, I haven't got around to doing a range test till now. This actually also shoots spitballs, so it is quite a unique toy blaster. It shoots these uh, interesting darts which are actually like a, think of it like a straw with then a dart on the end that's hollow so it's plastic. Uh, but it works in the same way that a Nerf dart works, with uh, just air that pushes out of the plunger and then uh, fires it out of the barrel. Um, so I will post a link to this item in the description. We need to show it some love, we haven't sold too many of these uh, bad boys. Uh, but let's see how it goes in the range test today. Okay, so the tape measure runs 60 feet to the shed, 18 metres. Let me just tighten that up. Here we go. And last one. Okay, let's go check out the results. All right. So the lowest dart landed, it's a bit hard to see in the grass actually because of that brown color. Just above 21 feet, uh, 6.5 meters. And the next one, there's two here that landed up at 25 feet, 7.7 .7 meters. Then the next two landed up at 8.2 meters, 27 feet. Okay, so the plastic darts range is, is okay. Um, the spitballs definitely shoot further, um, which is just basically paper and then you either, well, hygienic, you want to use water don't really want to chew it in your mouth but uh, the spitballs do shoot a little bit further than the darts. Uh, the spitballs because they're round when you uh, put it in the barrel of the gun and they're a lot smaller and heavier they uh, shoot quite a bit further. Anyway guys that completes the range test of the high cap of dart gun. I'll link in the description to this item. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.